and this is their this white because if you look this is actually white down here and so when they dug up their overburden and they put it right here that's all their tailings right there tailings you can come right here and here's their trench you can see it come down right there yeah for sure yeah and then it goes back there about three or four feet yeah i mean that would make sense yeah and so they were Jeez. working against the edge i don't know why they didn't work in the gut or maybe they didn't know the gut was right here but you see this folks look at this look at this line of sediment of silts it's all silts and they 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 literally worked into this bench by hand <laughs> i can't even imagine that's insane yeah, obviously the waste is like a white it's got like a white caliche yeah yeah it's right off the bedrock yeah it's right off the those bedrock. are rocks that should be down here but they're way up here because, because they, they worked it yep. from over there it's awesome it's, that's crazy it's a lot of dirt here and this has been going on up this creek you know they 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 worked like this up the creek we've seen quite a ways there. yeah it's Pretty it's much happened a lot any of the turns or benches that's you know, working these older older gravels there's definitely some bigger pieces in here oh yeah so i got two nice nuggets and in, in right where you're standing i got one and then one up there where it's shallow yeah killer looking bedrock yeah it's really hard and these are all the virgin gravels you said yep yeah yeah so somehow at one time yeah, this was creek they tossed it on top <clears throat> and then the silt came later yeah and you can see how it starts changing to white yeah a little bit and then yeah that's a trip my cool. oh my yeah it's uh there's probably some nice pieces in here still you can learn a, a lot about a creek by cutting them yeah. massive it's a bench cut. hole in this bench yeah, yeah. i mean yeah, there's color in all this too all the organics and silts sitting on top of everything it's wild that is wild there's like no rocks in or anything no yeah it's really strange hmm. yeah that's really neat so I was just vacuuming out uh, the top four riffles of this this Keen 151 tray and would you look at this can you guys see that look at that holy smokes let's take it into the shade here whoop can't see nothing in the shade look at that you guys look at that one just pulled that out of the top riffle on the Keen 151 box. Look at that crazy piece of gold. It's like a bunch of it's like a bunch of smashed up wires. Now that is what it's all about. You always want to see something like that in your top riffle. Holy smokes. I wish Boulder Dash was here. He could he could have uh, experienced that with me, but he's he's working on some stuff upstream. Yeah, what a nice piece of gold. So I know old. it's getting dark. But yeah, it's getting real dark. There's a see stuff. This is the top tray of and, the last um, run of the last of the day. Yep, basically. And right there. Oh my gosh! You know, that's just a this, huge piece. Let's see how big this thing. Oh man, well, it's a it's slug, dude. It is a <laughs> slug. <crap. laughs> nice. Oh, that's, that's at least a one grammar. Oh yeah, I feel man. The of it. Jeez. That's what you want to see in the dry washer. Wow. That's a good one. Yeah, that's right where it should be too, right in the middle. Yeah, pretty much. Dude, that's, yeah, I'd go gram easy. Excellent. Like 1.2 maybe. Shoot. Oh, that's fantastic.
Now we're going to re-attack our shells. Do recycle. Damn. Look at all Look that at gold. Oh. oh, boy. Like crystals, uh, the specific gravity matches the the description of the mineral, and also the crystal structure matches, and the colors match. So, pretty much probably going to be stolzite. And it's a localized source because these just suddenly have appeared yeah. just recently. Yeah, they all because they're so heavy. Their specific gravity is pretty high. It's like a eight or something, and they all these crystals hang out with the heavies and hang out with the gold. So. Yeah. yeah, anyway, pretty neat. Look at all that gold. That's good gravy. Nice chunky bits. There's bug spray on the excavator. Dude, you have so many on your legs, dude. Look at all the bugs. Yeah, the, there's freaking gnats everywhere. They like you more. Yeah. Your, your clothes are cleaner. It's got to be what it is. Yeah, it's like, it smells... Uh, you sure have a lot of vials. How do you ever keep things straight? I don't know how to, you know, you don't I, have it marked or anything. I forget where I find gold and then. Huh. So oh, these this. are these are all from that just stuff I picked out of the dry washer on that five hour run. So these are all the bigger pieces. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that's a nice. Look at that big old fatty. I don't even know how that made it through the screen. Look at that. That one there was from the end of the day last night. Yep, we got that one on video. It's exactly we'll one, one on gram, which was weird. Like literally 1.00. And this one was 1.6? 1 1.48. 1 oh, yeah. One and a half grammar. Yeah, this was a nice, that's a nice chunk there. And that was, uh, you were just like right under five, five right? Was yep. Like right under five. Barely under. So that's five grams in chunks and another probably ten, ten? in the in the dry washer yeah, of finds. Yeah, 15 gram day is yeah, probably pretty good. <laughs> yeah. And you only had to fight so. some, a couple of breakdowns. Yeah, check out these stoles like crystals I've been collecting. Yeah, I want to see these. It's, only, it's the only reason I'm here. These things are pretty cool. I, but there's Whoa. some gold in there too. Whoops. But <laughs> Look how awesome these, these are, guys. Look at these big old stolesites. And they're they're actually a really kind of a, a light red, dark orange color, pinkish. So, yeah, and they come in yellow, I think, and then uh, the, the shades between red and yellow. So yeah, some of those are massive. Yeah, really neat. Yeah, those neat. are neat. It's just different because they hang out with the gold. And uh, there's there's a yellow one right there. That's a good yellow one, but it's all rounded out. And uh, so it's been in the creek for a while. Yeah. Oh, and there's some gold too. <laughs> a couple pieces in there. That's from uh, they can't a really see trips those. ago. Yeah. Nice. Neat. Really neat. Wow. Fascinating. Excellent. <laughs> Look at that. Holy moly. Oh, weird. Dude. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That is like a lot of gold, dude. Yeah. Well, hey, I ran 17 hours. You only ran five hours. Yeah. Look at these finds right there. Powder. Look at that line. 
line of gold, guys. Oh, see that. Look at that good. line of gold. Yeah, that's impressive. Oh. Holy moly. It's probably Look at this. There anyways. Look at all that, you guys. Gee whiz. I sucked up so many pieces. Oh, today. yeah. Just so many. Wow. Well, yeah, it's that's better mega. when you have an excavator. That's all yeah. there is to it. You can run more material. How yeah. about that? Yeah, you can do more with well, one guy. Yeah. Hey, check this out, you guys. Look, so if you want to find gold like you just saw, you definitely want to be talking to Boulder Dash that's me. about his new four tray dry washer system. This is the, uh, this is the original. That's, that's right. And it's still running today, but Boulder Dash has redesigned it and completely just changed like a Everything. lot of stuff on it's it. It's just turnkey now. It's easy to run. So you just show up, you put the dirt on the top, and then you clean the gold out the bottom. It's yeah, basically it's, pretty simple. It's great, man. He's made it exceedingly easy for you to own one. He builds them. They, what are they, are they doing them? Uh, it's all built to order right built now, order. right? Built so, to order. Guys, if you really want to run material, you really want to find a lot of gold like you just saw, these work. Go get yourself an excavator or rent one. Or borrow one if you got a good friend. It's got everything. Generator, extension cords, spares of everything. Everything you need to just literally pull up and run. It's ready to go. I've thought of everything. I've got locks for the trailer. I got spare tire. I got trailer lights. I mean, I don't know, just it's, anything you can think of, I have that. I was like, what would I want? And that's what I did. Well, so. that's coming from a professional dry right. washer. Well, I Somebody who actually dry washes a lot. is building a dry washer that actually works. Yeah, that never happens. He's the happens. only one in this country that's building one that actually works. Oh, it does. It works good. <laughs> yeah, it's going to blow people's minds with how great of recovery. Um, yeah, we actually just sold one to a guy, and he just texted me. He's like... I'm finding so much gold and thank you. Like, just blowing his mind. He's like, yeah, I just pulled up and did what you said and I already got amazing gold. And it was like his first day, he's ecstatic. He's made this so easy for you to own one of these. This is a three bank, but he's got the four yeah. bank. That's what they're building now. Yeah. And I'm telling you, how do they get a hold of you? Uh, Boulder5- Spell it out at gmail.com And then maybe you're smart and you can put like the thingy on there. You give me too much credit. Yeah, well. Yeah, we'll put his. Well, I'll put his email right here somewhere, and I'll even put it in the description down below. Um, you know. Yeah, come come watch one run. Now you can go out and visit the site yeah. and demo it. Come see, see it. how. Yeah. 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 That's awesome. All right, guys, get a hold of him if you want to find a lot of gold, like like he does. Yeah, we'll talk to you guys soon.